Do you want to turn on or off closed captions on Amazon Fire TV? Then you are at the right place. We have got some easy ways to do that. Welcome back to Silicophilic, your go-to source for tech tips and fixes. Method 1. Turn on closed captions from settings. From your home screen, navigate to settings. Select accessibility. Go to closed caption. When turned on, this feature shows closed captions for videos when available. Select it to turn it off or on. When turned on, you will see a lot of features under this option like text, text background, window background, etc. Under the text option, you can change the text size, color, opacity, fint, or edge style. You can make the adjustments as per your preferences. You can change the text color to white, black, green, blue, yellow, magenta, or cyan. Next, if you go to text background, you can change the color and opacity. You can set a default color for the text background based on your preferences. If you want to keep it light, then use white. Method 2. Turn captions on or off while watching content. If you reset the closed captions option to the default now, then open an app like YouTube and you can see the option called captions over here. You can turn it off and on from here directly. You can also start playing the video you want to enable captions for. Press the menu button on your Fire TV remote or the Fire TV app. Navigate down and select subtitles or might also be labeled CC. You will see the current caption setting. Choose off to disable captions or select an available language to turn them on. Remember that not all content supports closed captions. Fire TV Stick first generation doesn't have a built-in captions option. Some apps might have their own settings for closed captions within the app itself. And there you have it. The two methods to turn on or off closed captions on Amazon Fire TV. We hope one of these methods have worked for you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and troubleshooting guides. Leave a comment and help others know which solution solved your problem. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.